I would just like to see more testing. I think that if we actually tested everybody the way the recommendations are in terms of age frame and um, not necessarily based on risk factor, we would really be able to identify everyone who is HIV infected. The main problem are these patients who are out there who have HIV and simply don't know it because of HIV's prolonged period of clinical latency. About a third, depending on where you are in the state, or in our area, it's a third, it can be up to a half, depending on if you're in a more rural area of the folks who we do diagnose with HIV. They've been living with it for five, eight, 10, 12 years without being diagnosed. We're really trying to advocate uh, for HIV testing in the community as far as educating um, providers, particularly in primary care, that HIV testing is now part of primary care. Because there's been a lot of stigma around HIV testing um, as far as how to do it, what does it mean when the patient has a positive diagnosis of HIV, to try and get folks to recognize that HIV testing is actually very easy to obtain and that there are providers out there who are very willing and able to take care of patients if and when they are diagnosed with HIV. Don't be discouraged if you find yourself with a diagnosis. Because if you get treated, it's untransmittable. You can live, you know. I always share with people that I think I'm in my 32nd year of living with HIV and AIDS. Um, yeah, and I have a pretty incredible life. You know, really over the past several years, this effort to prevent transmission is really possible. We just gotta get everybody involved and get everybody on board.